How do you encourage young mentees to take big bets on big edges? And how should this be taught at Caltech? Well, if you ask, how can Caltech teach people how to win chess tournaments or poker tournaments? You would find that some people at Caltech are very good at that and others aren't. And if you want to win at those things, you better bet on the people that are really very good at it. And not everybody is. I don't think Caltech can make great investors out of most people. I think great investors to some extent are like great chess players. They're, they're almost born to be investors. And that's because of the tolerance for risk? Is it the patience? What are the traits partly, of a great partly, investor? Yeah, obviously, you have to know a lot. But partly it's temperament. Partly it's deferred gratification. You got to be willing to wait. Good investing requires a weird combination of patience and aggression. And not many people have it. It also has to, it requires a big amount of self-awareness and how much you know and how much you don't know. You have to know the edge of your own competency. And a lot of brilliant people are no good at knowing the edge of their own competency. They think they're way smarter than they are. And of course, that, that's dangerous and causes trouble. So I, I think Caltech would have a hard time teaching everybody to be a great investor. But could it help people discover that they have that temperament? Or is this something that you mostly should try on your own? I think you find out whether you've got the qualities to win at poker by playing poker. That's a very empirical approach, Charlie. Yes, but I think it's right. Obviously, it helps to know the basic math of Fermat and Pascal. But everybody with any sense knows that stuff. But, but having the temperament where Fermat and Pascal are as much part of you as your ear and nose that's a different kind of a person. And I think it's hard to teach that. Warren and I have talked about this. In the early days, when we talked about our way of doing things, which was working so well, we found some people got it and they instantly converted to our way and did very well. And some people, no matter how carefully we explained it, and no matter how successful they were, they could never learn what, they could never adapt it. They either got it fast or they didn't get it at all. So that's my experience. Investing's not for everyone, says Munger. Like poker, it requires natural talent, risk tolerance, patience, and investors' sixth sense. Caltech teaches finance, but the true edge comes from within. Play the game, test your temperament. Knowledge helps, think Pascal, but gut feeling reigns supreme. Buffett saw it too, some grasped his method instantly, others never could. Find your passion, explore, invest if it truly resonates. Remember, there's life beyond investing and more to learn on Invest Avenue.